So this new Android 15 beta update is released and this is Android 15's QPR1 beta 3. The QPR1 update is the stable version of QPR1 is coming in December and we have another beta right now available. Of course, it's a little bit upgraded version as compared to the normal official stable version, which if you are using with Android 15, but in this case, it's a beta version. Unfortunately, with this new beta update, which is QPR1 beta 3, we do not have any major visual changes, but some of the minor changes are here. For example, the themed icons are a bit more changed or there is a minor change in the themed icons, colors, you can say in other words, or you can say contrast. Whenever you install this thing, you can you will notice if you are using Android 14 or if you are using previous Android 15 update, you might notice a bit of change, not a major change at all. Second, which I found here in this one is, which is of course not live yet. According to uh, Mishal Rahman, we have uh, this information available. It looks like the quick settings panel might be revamped with the upcoming update of QPR1, although it's not guaranteed yet, but it looks like because there are some changes in the strings etc so it could be quite exciting if we get anything new with the quick settings panel with the upcoming updates even with android 15 having a look at some of the other changes here the settings panel basically the settings ui was also changed with the previous qpr beta update so in case you are using android 15 stable version you can update that to the beta version to this update so you will get this new settings ui and in other upcoming updates you might see some new changes with the settings ui for example some of the minor visual changes not major but only minor one thing which I, which I found in the previous update, basically it is already in the previous update, is the charging optimization feature. As far as I know, it is not available with the stable update, not so sure, but if you are into the beta updates, if you are using the previous beta updates, this was already there. And yes, the good thing is, it is present with the beta 3 too. This is the beta 3 which I am talking about, which is QPR1 beta 3. Also, one more thing was changed with the previous QPR beta update, and that was this keyboard language change. Or you can change this thing by just tapping at the right bottom, bottom right basically. And as far as I know, this is also changed with this. I mean, if you are using the stable version, in my case, I was using a stable version. So this is a change for me if you go back to the stable update. Although we do not have any other major changes. So so these are some visual changes which you have here you might see some minor changes with the volume panel with the upcoming update not so sure but maybe and of course the quick settings panel which i've already told you so these were the changes i just wanted to let you know if you want to go to beta you can try out this right now so this is it thanks for watching let's see you in the next one take care